parents should make sure that kids aren't going out acting as though they're armed. Can you spot a fake gun? Turns out many people can't. Good evening, I'm Paul Cicchini. And I'm Jennifer Roscoe. Urbana police want parents to tell their children to keep fake guns off the street. They confronted several teenagers this weekend after they got a tip a caller saw them walking around with guns. WCNI3's Emily Braun is live in Champaign now. And Emily, these guns can look really real. Yeah, police say it can be very easy to mistake a BB gun for an actual one. So to address that, let me let you take a look at this. I took this picture to this park and put some people's instincts to the test. Do you think these guns look real? Yes, I do think they look real. Yes. Yeah. What if I told you these were BB guns? They look very real. Oh, that's shocking. Someone called Urbana police and reported seeing teenagers walking around with guns. That caller was fooled, and so were most people I asked in the park. Then Lieutenant Richard Searles decided to put me to the test. Okay, so on this board, there's 13 guns. And I want you to look at this board. I'm just going to let you look at it for just a second. And I want you to tell me how many of these 13 are real. Let me know when you got a good look. I'll give you five, four, three, two, one. Okay. This one is real. It's fake. I think this one's real. Fake. Let me help you out. They're all fake. To the untrained eye, it's tough to spot the difference. They're absolutely designed to look like they're real. That's why he says the caller did the right thing. Parents need to be involved in their children's lives, and they need to make sure that they're not going out there in the general public with things that look like real firearms, because there's no point. Brittany Coleman learned that lesson the hard way. My son actually left the house with the BB gun, and one of our neighbors thought it was a real gun, and the police ended up coming back to bring the gun back to our house. Searle says the bottom line is it's better to play it safe and pick up the phone and be assured. If it's a BB gun, we will deal with it just like some kids with BB guns. Searle said you also have to be careful with guns that look like they're obviously fake. He says some people will paint orange tips on real guns and make some guns even to look like squirt guns. So he says if you have any doubt, don't touch it, don't interfere, just call police. Live in Champaign, Emily Baron, WCI3, your local news leader. Yeah, no reason to have any of those in the first place anyway. All right, Emily, thank you so much.